Uh, it took me a while after the tournament to kind of like settle in and just think of what is going to happen in the future and the tournament's coming up. At the moment, it just, I couldn't even realize what was going on. There was some, it was so chaotic, but then it took me a few weeks to kind of realize what was going on. From there, it was like, all right, this is the final round. So I could either, either have that mindset of, if I stay strong and patient, make some birdies coming in, I can still have a chance. Or it's like, okay, don't put yourself out of the tournament. So I just stayed patient. I knew that anything could happen, right? That four, yeah. How about that four? Wow. He still has a chance. Yeah, so as, as soon as like the round was over, it was just nonstop media for four to five hours. And I mean, that's one point I was nervous, but then I just kind of like, all right, let me just talk and then it'll flow out. And then, but after the round, I had all my guys there, all the guys from the Caribbean, Jamaica, my boy Justin from here, the, all the Bayesians, they were there. Like we came together as a little group. Um, you can see we had a little Caribbean link up at the end, just kind of supporting each other, which was nice to see, to see the support. It's good, I mean, this is like my second home. Just growing up here, my brother, Pei, myself, Justin, all the other juniors, we would just come out here and stay out here till eight, nine o'clock at night sometimes. Like, we would just be here all day. In the afternoon after school, we'd come down and they welcome us every single day. So it feels great to come back here and know that this is like a second home for me. What North Sound Golf Club has done throughout the years is we've created a safe, fun environment for these kids to, to grow up and learn the game. Um, we've provided them opportunities to play and to practice uh, within these junior programs and just created a culture where they could come out uh, and spend all day every day and learn the game and play. That's how I learned the game. So I, when I first started playing, uh, I, I played at a public course and, and the rest of the golfers were very welcoming. I think most of the professional staff that's come running through here for the last 10 years, they got their start in the very same way. So we kind of have a, an inherent responsibility to, to pass that forward to the kids that are taking up the game now. Um, and secondly, uh, when Dart purchased this property, they made it a priority that they wanted to be kind of all encompassing. It's not just for the, the adult members. We want to make sure that we, we develop the kids uh, to learn and to grow the game as well because quite honestly they're going to be our future members 10, 20, 30 years down the road. I'm looking forward to the challenge. I'm looking forward to competing with those guys. I know if I put in the work then I can compete with them so it's going to be a, a fun week. <laughs>